Welcome back to Quick Tips. Today I'm going to show you how to remove the hotkeys that the AMD Radeon software puts into Windows by default, especially if you're a guy like me who likes to use a lot of hotkeys. A lot of those things that AMD automatically puts in can really mess you up. I'm going to show you where it is, how to remove them, and how to bind them to different things if you still want to use this service. So a lot of the time when I'm working with Audacity, I want to quickly export my audio once I've done recording a video. So I always just press Control plus Shift shift plus E. And instead of actually exporting my audio, it saved the screenshot. Normally, if I wanted the screenshot, I'd just use the snip and sketch tool that's built right into Windows that uses the Windows key. So I know that I'm doing a Windows action. The way that you fix this, literally just right click on your desktop, click on the first option, which is the AMD Radeon software, and then go to the gear icon up at the top right of this window, and then click on the hotkeys tab. And some of these are kind of cool, to be honest. This software actually allows you to record videos, do live streaming directly from inside of it. There's a hotkey to toggle streaming, to toggle your microphone. But for me, all I want to do is delete these. What you have to do is press where you see the hotkeys listed and then press the delete key on your keyboard. And as you can see, it sets that over to none. Let's say you want to keep one of these hotkeys, hover over to where you see the first box here and press the undo button and that'll restore the original hotkey. If you want to bind a different hotkey, all you have to do, press that button button on your keyboard and it will change it to that hotkey. So I'm just going to go and delete all of these because I don't use this software. Never have and probably never will. And boom, that's all you have to do. And if I pop back on to Audacity, do control shift E. Now I can easily export my audio once again. So thank you guys for watching this quick tips. I hope that this helped you out and I'll catch you all in the next video. Bye bye.